guilty. That is the verdict in the trial of a former Greenwood Village police officer accused of shooting and killing a 17 year old. But the jury came back with a lesser charge, manslaughter. That decision came down about an hour ago. Peyton Blitzstein had just turned 17 when he was killed in November 2021. Doorbell video camera shows Adam Holland confronting Blitzstein and his friends about speeding through a Southeast Aurora neighborhood. As the argument escalated, doorbell video shows both Holland and Blitzstein pulling out guns and firing. Your reporter Karen Morfitt live at the Arapahoe County Courthouse for us right now. And Karen, Holland was facing a murder charge, but he was found guilty of manslaughter. Yeah, a second degree murder charge here in the family, of course, wanting to see that higher charge, wanting to see him guilty of that higher charge and potentially more time behind bars. But they say this does bring some closure, something that they have been waiting years for. 17 year old Peyton Blitzstein was killed more than two years ago, shot and killed outside his home in Aurora in 2021. Today, a jury again found Adam Holland guilty of manslaughter and not guilty of felony menacing. The shooting was caught on a ring doorbell camera and affidavit revealed later that Holin was drunk at the time he chased down and confronted Blitzstein and several other teenagers for allegedly speeding through that neighborhood. Both Holin and Blitzstein pulled out guns during the encounter and both fired. Holin argued that the teen fired first, but that was not clear on the video. Blitzstein's family and his defense has always been that Holin was the aggressor. We are thankful that he's going to be in essence going away paying for his crimes, um, but the emotions are all over the place because we've been dealing, it for, dealing with it for two and a half years and the fact that it's finally come to an end, um, it's, I'm, we're thankful that it, it's to the end. Holin was not taken into custody today. Instead, he will return to the Arapahoe County Courthouse in May for sentencing. We're live in Arapahoe County. Karen Morfitt covering Colorado First. All right, Karen, thank you.